Now we're going back to Blake East and he is at Tusculum Elementary School in South Nashville where students are set to receive a pretty big surprise this morning. The surprise comes from Santa, but it's really folks in the community who are behind this Blake and we love to see these kinds of happy holiday stories. Absolutely, Nikhil. You could not have said it any better yourself. So if you're just now joining us, we're here at Tusculum Elementary, where 150 first graders are set to receive all of their Christmas wish lists fulfilled right here today. We showed you all the presents that wrapped the gym, and now we're showing you even more. All of these bikes right here will be going long, going home to a few uh, lucky students who maybe wrote them down uh, as a letter to Santa on their wish list this year. Now, joined by Laura Quirring. She's the mastermind teacher behind all of this. Uh, Ms. Quirring, what I love about this story is you started this in Chicago. You taught in Chicago for 10 years. This all started when you realized that there was a student who did not get a Christmas gift when they came back after the holidays. And so now you've created this program. So many folks are wondering, what is the operation like this, the logistics involved? Obviously, we know Santa has his hand in all of this, but this would not be possible without our community help right here in Nashville. No, the response here in Nashville has been amazing. They have given and given and called and said, what else can I do? Can I help the teachers? Can I help anything else? They have been so unbelievably generous. They just want to help, and it's so rewarding for me to see them to see it continue to grow here as it did in Chicago. Right. So think about it. This is the very first year it's happening here in Nashville, but obviously the first year, definitely not the last year. How could folks get involved if they want to get their hand in this? Santa always needs some help. You can reach me at secret Santa teacher MNPS at gmail.com. I answer it as quickly as I can. Sometimes it's faster than others, especially right now. But yes, they can. I would love to be able to do the whole school next year. I mean, what an incredible goal right there. And really quick, you know, we're about a couple minutes away from all the te all the students coming in here to get those mm -hmm. gifts. What's going through your mind right now? How do you feel? It's exciting, you know. Um, it's it's overwhelming. It's almost like when you're getting married, the moment before you walk out that down the aisle. It's and you because I know everything. I know what they wanted. I know they're getting it, and it's just. Yep. Eek! You know, you is. really want to, you want them to see them. They're going to be so excited. Yes, Ms. Quirin, thank you so much for having us. We'll have more on their reactions, Nikel, coming up News 2 at 4. Based off the screams you're hearing from behind us, you definitely want to make sure you're tuned into that because it is going to be a reaction that I think we all could use uh, during this time of the year. Live here in Nashville, Blake Easton, News 2. Uh, this is so awesome. I'm smiling so hard right now, Blake, and just to see our educators do so much for their kiddos and for the community is so heartwarming. So we'll definitely be watching for that video later today, Blake. Thanks so much.